Hi viewers, today I am actually going to be testing out a new tool I got. So I got a tool for charging batteries. So the morale of the story is that usually there's a level to which if your battery drops, you know, it becomes difficult for the car to charge it up. Mm -hmm. So typically if your battery wouldn't be able to if your battery has gone flat, if it's gone to like maybe like um, 10 volts plus or, you know, that kind of thing and it's not able to start your car. Car systems, the alternator is generally not exactly designed to be able to charge a weak battery from, you know, from being flat to getting back to full health. So I would be... I would be um, testing out this new gear. So first of all, I would want to take out this battery. So here we are, battery is out of the vehicle. I've hooked up the, the charger. So I haven't connected the charger to the mains, but um, so what you're seeing there is the voltage of the battery, 11.2. Any battery less than 12.6 is not um, optimal and definitely less than 12 is um, that's that's um, that's low. So um, what you're seeing now is the outside temperature. So it's about four degrees where I am. So I want to see the correlation of this with the multimeter. OK, so same goes multimeter reads it at 11.2 um, this reads at 11.2 as well so that, that's fine 11.3 no, whatever so the the way to charge this the instruction says I'll just remove the leads for this multimeter right out of the way so this is a 70 amp battery. Uh, where's that? Yeah, 70 amp hours battery. So I would expect that this will get charged in about 13 hours. So coming back to this, it simply says hook it up um, and then connect this to the mains. <sighs> And then once you connect to the mains, so it says charging, and it tells you the amperage that is charging at. So it's charging at uh, 5.8 amps, amp hours at those the, at that voltage. This has a number of modes. It has winter mode, summer mode, normal mode, um, and it had very good reviews on Amazon including people who, who claim that he resurrected their dead batteries so either way i'm curious to see what this would do so i'll need to leave this for the next 13 hours and i'll come back so i'm back it's this now says full and it took just about um about 11 12 hours thereabouts so I'm going to turn this off and then take readings um, today and then also take some readings tomorrow morning and um, basically this battery was unable to start the car so let me see what the voltage is so I've disconnected and it's reading 13.3 um yeah i would i would check this again tomorrow and of course the real test will be starting the car so here i am day two it's it was left sitting overnight outside in the bitter cold so i'm going to see what voltage the battery is at
7 degrees and it's at 13 volts so that looks good um, yeah I know the ultimate thing to do would have been to do a load test I don't have a load tester um, but I'll put this in the vehicle so here we are car started so all good next thing I'm going to do is a power stick draw on this car because I need to find out where this current is leaking from Alright, cheers. Thanks.